here we are for KCON day one. I am super excited. We just parked in the um, uh, parking lot and we're making our way up to the uh, convention center. We gotta check in. Everything's under my name apparently. And so yeah, can't wait to see what the convention is like and the concert tonight. Both days actually. So yeah. It's only 5 o'clock. We've been right here since 4.30. It feels like hours, but we're basically just sitting out here in the sun. But yeah, we're hoping to get in. We've been here since 4.30, and so we're just trying to get a good spot. Let's hope we get in. Just a quick update. Um, we're still out here. It's around like 6 p.m. at this point. I'm wearing this thing so I can block the sun out of my peripheral vision, so that's why you see me wearing this. We're still waiting out here, we've got about 20 more minutes, hopefully everything will be all smoothly inside and it's going to be air conditioned. That's what I'm hoping for. Okay, see you inside. So this is the show! This is KCON. We're right now we're currently waiting for the show to start, we just got in, we're on the floor. So yeah, I am super excited. Concert footage incoming.
my all-time favorite. Oh my fucking god. Love you. Love you.
It's about two in the morning. Um, the concert's over. The concert ended around like midnight, and uh, we decided to go out to eat at um, uh, at uh, a local diner, which thankfully was still open. But yeah, it was absolutely amazing. I am still reeling. So many great idols. So many amazing acts. Oh my God, Itzy, Kepler, and Hypen, Stray Kids. Just hit after hit after hit, I was living. I have some footage of the finale, but my phone was only on 3% because my battery decided to die on me while we were waiting in line. Backup battery decided to bail on me while we were waiting in line. And I was hoping to use that time to recharge my phone so I can record the concert. Apparently my phone just had to die at the very end, at the finale. At least it lasted most, but you get the idea. Something that wasn't captured on screen was Pointing by from Kepler, um, uh, as she and the other Kepler members were making their way around the stage during the finale, waving to the fans, like uh, I started bouncing up and down, saying like, "Bye, my beloved!" And so she started blowing kisses straight at me, and I probably would have fainted right then and there. I was on the floor, so uh, the reason why I was in that line earlier because we were all on the floor. We checked in earlier and everything. It was all very efficient, thankfully. We were on the floor and then we found this little nook near the corner of the stage, which is where you see all my footage is. And then from there, and then from there, turns out right behind us is where the idols would come out from backstage and walk on. And so while I was focused on the main stage, my sister who was behind me was focused more on the hallway behind us <laughs> Dude, Jake fell in love with me. Bye, fell in love with me. We both found our loves today. Yeah. Oh my god. While at the convention, I happened to stop by the Choice Music LA booth and I bought some albums. Let's unbox them and see what I pull. So the three albums I bought today were Yes or Yes by Twice, the Eve solo album from Luna, and one of my dream albums that I never thought I'd get my hands on, Red Velvet Summer Magic one of my favorite eras. Let's start off with Eve. Since it's a soul album, I know who I'm gonna get. There's really no surprises in this one. Overall, I really like the sound of her solo song. Very retro, and just the feel of the video perfectly encapsulated that as well. So yeah, I can't wait to listen to this. There she is. Now where's the card? Ah, oh. Look at this. Look how pretty that is. She is so gorgeous. Let's save my dream album for last. Okay, so Yes or Yes by Twice. The era before Fancy. Still one of my favorite eras though. Oh, I got Momo, I got Momo on the CD. Hold on. I got Momo on the CD. Now where are my photo cards? Okay. I'm trying not to look at him. Okay. What is this? <gasps> oh, what is this? Oh, it's the the strip. I got Sana, Gio, and Mina. Let's go. Now for the actual cards. <gasps> Mina. We got Mina. We got Mina. Let's go. Let's go. We're off to a great start. <gasps> Julie. Yes, our visual queen. Ah, yes, Cheung, my little artist tiger, with the iconic yes or yes pose. Next? Oh, oh, this is the hand pick. I don't know whose hands these are, though. I know Mina's holding the disco ball, but I don't know who's holding this one. And then lastly, ah, Jonghyun! Oh man, she looks so young. She looks good in flannel and a spike choker. 
All right, last but certainly not least, Red Velvet Summer Magic. This is one of my dream albums, which I thought was discontinued. And knowing that there are rare editions of these, I thought I would never get one of these. I'm glad I pounced on that opportunity. Ah, yes. All right, so this is the photo book and the CD. Now, let's see where the cards are. Okay, I'm not looking. Fan art event, when was, oh, 2018. 2018, fan art event. That's probably from when this was printed. Okay, okay, so we got one photo card and I think I know who, already, who it already is because it's her signature color. It's Yeri. I love Yeri, oh my gosh. Definitely not as much as Wendy, who is my ult for this group, but I love Yeti nonetheless. And this is just from day one of KCON LA 2022. Let's see if I get any more on day two and let's and be prepared for more concert footage. All right.